Hello, welcome to Lindell Brakes. Today we're going to be talking about our gold physical vapor deposition finish on our rotors. Many of you have seen this on a variety of styles and finishes that we have, but today we want to talk about uh, this gold physical vapor deposition finish. Many times we get a question asking, you know, how will the gold stay on the rotors? How will it, how will, will the gold last? It is a surface finish on a wear surface, so keep that in mind. It doesn't make the rotor stop any better. It's purely for aesthetic purposes, akin to a polished rotor or something like that. It is a 90 Rockwell, which is quite hard. It's on a B-scale durometer, and it's very thin at 5 micron. So it's, it's a decorative finish, and with that, we often get asked, you know, how will the gold last once I start riding the bike? And uh, that's a great question, and it's a question that we want to address in this video. So to do that, I have two illustrations here. As you know, we have four different compounds of brake pads, uh, starting with our softest, which is our Z Plus performance pad, up to our hardest, which is our centered race pad. So for, for the preservation of this gold, or, or any of our surface finishes, honestly, or even a polished rotor, we highly recommend our Z Plus High Performance Street Pad because it is super soft, it's absolutely benign, preserves the surface of the disc, it doesn't throw any dust, it, it boasts a very high service life of about 18,000 miles. First you can see the material transfer that's taken place on this disc. It would almost look like the pad took the surface finish off of the rotor, but that's not the case. This is much like a clutch in that the friction material from the brake pad has now transferred to the surface of the disc making this effectively one big brake pad turning against two small brake pads. And this is what offers the feel and torque that we uh, boast on our brake pads. So, so you can see also that the low-lying areas, the gas slots, the crown on the OD and the crown on the ID all maintain their original beautiful luster. And so it's, it's kind of a nice contrast, you know, you, some people, I, I personally, I, I like this contrast. But for this illustration, I just want to show you that this material transfer is a material transfer. I'm going to remove it with a common pink rubber eraser. And so to do that, I'm just going to lay this disc down on the table, and I'm going to focus on one of these pads right here. Takes a little bit of elbow grease, so don't be shy. But I'm going to rub this material transfer off of this disc and you can see with just a little bit of effort and time that I did indeed pull off the, the uh, transfer of the friction material and with a closer close up you can actually see the crosshatch of the, of the material so you can still see the original double disc grinding that we do underneath the friction material transfer. The Z pad is our softest pad and it has our lowest torque rating. So we do offer uh, our Gold Plus high performance pad, our Extreme, and our centered race pads. And they go up the durometer scale hard, harder, hardest, basically. So if you were to run our hardest pad on this gold finish, it would remove the surface finish on the surface because this pad generates a lot of temperature and it's very light lever effort for a lot of stopping torque. It's a high energy brake pad. But if you couple it with the uh, physical vapor deposition finish, it, it, it will remove it. And here I can show you the high shiny spots of the disc where the physical vapor deposition has been removed. You can still see that it has maintained its original luster in the gas slots and the low-lying areas and the and in the crown area so it, it still uh, offers a nice contrast and again I want to uh, reiterate that this is a surface finish on a wear surface and it's for decorative use only it's it's for aesthetics it's just some added bling if you want our biggest stopping power then go to our full race centered pad and go to a raw substrate a, a raw disc an, uncoated disc uh, is, is going to offer you the most in stopping performance. So with that said, I'd like to thank you for joining us. We'll see you next time.